Today we have a short walkthrough on the custom turret tool on our website. We're going to show you how to set one up, add to cart, and start shooting. Custom turrets are designed to match your specific ammunition, rifle setup, and shooting conditions, enabling precise bullet drop compensation. Replace your standard elevation turret with a custom turret marked with yardages to make quick, accurate infield adjustments. It is important to note, the effectiveness of your custom turret depends on the accuracy of the information provided. Major inaccuracies can arise from incorrect ballistic data or significant changes in shooting conditions. Jumping right into the custom turret configurator, take note of the rifle scope model tab. Identifying your specific model of rifle scope is important as your custom turret is designed to fit this exact model. You can find the model number and description of your rifle scope on the box, in the user manual, or from the rifle scope's body. Again, this is very important to make sure that your custom turret fits perfectly. Take note of the Rifle Scope Adjustment tab. We'll need to know whether your rifle scope is using MOA, or Minute of Angle, or Milliradian, MRAD for short. Here again, this very specific information is unique to your rifle scope and will determine whether or not your custom turret is going to adjust accurately. You can find this information on your rifle scope's box, in the user manual, or engraved on the factory turret itself. Next will be the Cartridge tab. If you're shooting factory ammunition, this information can be found on the factory ammunition box. It can also be found engraved on the rifle's barrel, or if you're using a Wildcat, you can select Custom. In the Bullet Weight tab, you'll specify your projectile's weight as measured in grains. In the Bullet tab, you'll select your specific bullet make and model. You can find this information again on the ammunition box or the bullet box if you're a hand loader. If you're running a custom projectile, simply select Custom. Once you've selected a specific bullet, you'll notice the bullet specifications fields will all fill out with predetermined values. At any point in time, if your data is different, you can amend these. For instance, your bullet manufacturer may list a ballistic coefficient of X, but in validation you find it's actually slightly different for the most robust ballistic solution possible. Your custom turret is cut for a limit of one full rotation of adjustment. If you selected a custom bullet, or if you need to amend any of this data, some brief definitions. Cal, or caliber, in inches. Simply put, the bullet's diameter. An example, 6.5 Creedmoor is 0.264 inches in diameter. Weight again measured in grains. That same 6.5 Creedmoor, for example, 129 grains. Length refers to the total length of the projectile as measured from base to tip in inches. Drag function is the ballistics model used to describe the bullet's resistance to air drag, G1 or G7. With modern projectiles, G7 is more common and preferred for those longer boat-tailed bullets. Metro, Army or ICAO are standards at which atmospheric conditions affecting ballistics apply. Ballistic coefficient is a measurement of the bullet's aerodynamic efficiency. That coefficient is usually found with the bullet or ammunition manufacturer specifications, again expressed in a G1 or G7 drag function. In the Rifle Specifications tab, we'll need some particulars about your setup. Sight height will refer to the measurement between the center of the bore and the center of the optic. To measure this, use a ruler or caliper to find the height from the middle of the rifle's barrel to the middle of the rifle scope's body at the mounting point. Zero range in yards or meters. Quite simply, this is the distance at which you wish your rifle scope to be zeroed. Muzzle velocity, of course, refers to the projectile speed as it exits the barrel. We strongly recommend using a chronograph to verify this information. While most ammunition companies will post muzzle velocity on the ammunition box, it's likely that your rifle will print a different number. Using a chronograph will guarantee the highest level of accuracy possible. Average altitude is the typical elevation in feet where you'll be shooting or hunting. Using topographical maps, GPS devices, or online mapping services, you can find this information out fairly easily. Take note, however, large changes in elevation can have adverse effects on trajectory. Moving from a low elevation to a high elevation will typically require less correction for holdover. Likewise, a turret cut at sea level will have different requirements at higher elevations. The average temperature will be measured in degrees Fahrenheit. Here again, this will be based off of the region or area that you'll be shooting or hunting. Estimating this based on the historical average for the location or using weather data services can be very helpful. Here again, changes in temperature can adversely affect your bullet's path. 
A turret cut for summer conditions might not perform the same in winter and vice versa. Distance units will refer to the preferred measurement for distance either in yards or meters that you would like your data displayed at. This choice will determine how we cut the custom turret to calibrate for range adjustments. The custom turret name will allow you to name your custom turret anything you'd like for easy identification. If you leave this field blank, we'll automatically populate it with your input values. Caliber, bullet type, muzzle velocity, weight, average altitude, and distance units. Once you've completed all these fields, simply add your custom turret to the cart and run through the checkout process. Custom turrets are optimized for specific environmental conditions, meaning changes in temperature or elevation can impact their accuracy. For instance, a turret calibrated for summer might not be accurate in winter, and one set for low elevation may falter at higher altitudes. If you experience significant variations in the environment that you're going to be hunting or shooting in, it's advisable to have a custom turret for each distinct environment to ensure precision in your shots. If you need help finding the ideal environmental solutions for you, or have any other questions or needs regarding custom turret setup, you can call us at 1-800-4-VORTEX for assistance anytime.